Hello, everyone. First of all, I really want to just say my heart feels burst open by this summit. Is anybody out there feeling that too? I'd like to say thank you to the Wellbeing Summit organizers and supporters and creators, really, truly, um, for this opportunity to collaborate and to work together with uh, Dr. Richard Davidson. Um, it's just, I very much look forward to being here. Truly, this momentum that I am feeling that we are all going to delve into ourselves and what all this means and get out in the world and enact it. So what I would like to do is um, I, I have created experimental films uh, in collaboration with Dr. Davidson. Um, so I'm about to show you four trailers. They are four experimental shorts that were created especially for this neuroscience and well-being uh, project, an immersive workshop, which will happen later. Um, so why don't we just run the trailer, and then I will speak afterwards. So that was a sneak peek. Um, my work has for years really been inspired by asking myself the question, what is the nature of mind and reality? And um, I, I am quite amazed that others here have shared personal experiences that led them to certain awakenings and understanding. For me, it was the passage of my father when I was 24, and it blew me away. I had no idea how I would relate to my father and what was this thing called mortality. And as I researched into it, because I tend to be academic, I started reading and learning more about mind and, and uh, how we understand uh, phenomena all around us, including birth, living, and death. So um, I have learned through the years uh, that developing awareness of our own minds. While we experience life as a flow of changing circumstances and changing moments is a core foundation of inner balance and well-being. 
And um, so my current work really is essentially my exploring this. It is non-narrative, experimental films. I aim to explore concepts of self in a captivating way, hopefully. And silhouettes is often the way that, um, uh, the form that I use to explore. And I hope to point viewers towards experiencing themselves in the world differently and to recognize that one's sense of self, your sense of self, is actually far more expansive than it appears. This is what I think anyway as an artist. <laughs> So, um, I do hope that, uh, you know, you will come join us later. Uh, what I do is really, I think of it as recreating reality, I'm representing phenomena. And uh, it, hopefully it is to stimulate your perception that it's not reality, but it is an expression of reality. Um, so I do hope that you will join Dr. Richard Davidson and, and me later for this afternoon's workshop. Um, those experimental films will be fully screened uh, during an immersive inquiry into the nature of mind. Uh, Dr. Davidson is going to guide you through practices of an inner direct experience of direct observations based on his innovative work and research on the brain bases of emotions. Um, and together with experiencing the films, we hope to create a visceral, transporting experience for you uh, today in the creative, interactive self-discovery. And it will be held um, in Lantejo 1, which is at uh, Ascuna Zentroa. Uh, it will be in a spacious, open venue where you can uh, move, allow for collective movement and interaction. I highly encourage you to come and experience with us, and as the titles of the film may suggest, that you may search for who are you? Who am I? What is your essence in, your essence out? Um, as you ponder neuroreflections in seeking the nature of mind. Um, and the workshops, we will be going through the four pillars of um, well-being, as uh, Dr. Davidson so emphatically and energetically described. I thank you. Please come join us.